happy to do? Jesus. How are you? How are you feeling? I'm nervous. Oh my god, me too. I can't do it. Jesus. No, you can do it. Thanks, what can I do? I look okay. Big chance. I look okay. Yeah, you look great. Let me see. Let me look at your nose. Put your head up. You okay? You oh, know? No, no, you're all right. You're all right. You're all right. Okay. okay, now you know what, how this goes, how this is going to work, Biddy Doe. Oh. One of us has to be the presenter, okay? So, there's a short straw and there's a long straw. So, which one's which? Well, I'm not telling you now. You get to go. So, hold on. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch your mother by her toe. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Okay, now, the short straw. The short straw is the one that has to do it. Oh, Linda. Okay. No, no. <laughs> oh my god, Bailo. Linda, no. No, Bailo. <laughs> I'm leaving. Don't be up, Bailo. Oh. You pull the short straw. So okay. It's, so it's your turn, okay? I think we have to go. Okay, I think they're announcing this. All right. You ready? Okay. Okay, we look pretty? I guess we look all right. That's as good as it's gonna get. Okay. Right. Where's the stage? Right over here. Shh. to give us $1,500 at 10% interest for our company called Betty Lou and Linda's Home Brazilian Kit. Which has a natural sideline, and it's called Betty Lou and Linda's Faux Part Prince of Famous Bearded Men, and that'll become very clear a little later on. Now, the first thing you must ask is the why. Why home Brazilian kids for the home, Linda? Well, <laughs> money and privacy. You see, over the course of a lifetime, it can cost you an awful lot of money to get your, uh, to get your, your bush attended to. <laughs> Jesus. Well, what am I supposed to say? Linda, gee, say the Hail Mary. Well, that's what it is, it's a bush. Yes. Betty Lou, for Christ's sake. I'm sorry, dragons. Anyway, and um, you know, depending on your genes, <laughs> that's G-E-N-E-S, not J-E-N-N-S. Well, depending on your genes, you might have to have it done every two or three weeks. And at 50 bucks a pop, that's a lot of trips to Punta Cana. <laughs> Now, the second you must ask is, you know, see the privacy part. You see, some women can just bite on a bullet and moan while the rest of us sound like the next hog in line at the slaughterhouse. So what we're proposing is that you, you get to take care of yourself in the privacy of your own home. So, you know, you, you wait until your husband's out mending his lobster traps or tapping trees or he's gone down to the Legion or an AA meeting, whatever it is. And you get out your kit, you put Nana Muscori on the hi-fi, you get a nice cold beer, and Bob's your uncle, you can sing the high notes like Whitney Houston if you want, or curse like a drunken sailor. It's very therapeutic. Now it's time to unfold the centerpiece to our expedition, and it's called 
Betty Betty Lou Lou and and Linda's electric chair. So, what you do is you take a nice sturdy kitchen chair, but it has to have a removable seat. And then you go and get the white duct tape. That's the only kind that will work. And that's why we need the $1,500, because they only get it at the dollar store and it sells out like that. So we have to stockpile it, right? So you cover the seat with the extra strength duct tape. Anyway, it'll all become very clear in a few moments because Betty Lou drew the short straw, so she's going to give us a demonstration. So we'll all close our eyes while Betty Lou gets ready. Betty Lou! Betty Lou! No! Betty Lou! It's national television. You stroke, you've got the short straw. I'm not doing it. Betty Lou! I'm leaving. I'm you back. Okay, never mind, never mind, okay. Okay, Betty Lou. There's been a change, dragons. I'm going to be the demonstrator. <laughs> All right. Well, turn away and close your eyes. Give me a little privacy. I wasn't ready for this. Oh, help me, Betty Lou. Lift, lift, lift. Okay, it's all right. So you sit squarely on the seat. And you count from 10 to 1 backwards slowly, and I suggest you do your kugels. So it works better if you do the kugels. Pretend you're getting ready for childbirth. Okay, you're going to count with me, Betty Lou. Now get in behind. So when we're ready to get this thing off, it's coming off. Okay. Ten. Count with me. Yeah. Nine. Eight. <laughs> seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Get ready, me, Lou. Two. One. Pull it off. No. Pull it off. Pull it off. I hate this part. Last time. Betty Lou! I was picking corn in my ears for two weeks. Wow, Betty Lou, you swore you'd never bring it up and again. And then there was that time you lost mine because left your hair is too long. Betty Lou! I'm telling you right now, I'll cut you with a butter knife. No. Okay, I'm gonna count one more time and you're gonna help me. Okay. Get ready, get in behind. Three, two, one, go! Oh!
How did you think we did? I think we did okay. Oh my god, I think we got the money. You think we got the money? Oh my god, we're Oh my god, I, I need, need a, a distribution center. I Isn't need, that what they call it? I need a tub of ice to sit in. Oh my god. Holy Jesus. Do they have liquor? Huh? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we can get another little puff. Oh, that'd be better. Yeah, okay. Oh All my right. jeez. <sighs> Do you think we'll be rich? Can we fall?